Kalahari Jones, the congested taxi lines packed with commuters caught up in the bustle of the city, streets bursting of the hustle, and dreams of our people to picture perfect views of the African landscape. Feel, touch, smell, taste South Africa, Mzanzi, Africa Burwa. These are her reflections. David Ofense Murunko. Um, coming from Pretoria in a place called Harankua, uh, Zone 7. Uh, I'm a full time artist, um, uh, also part of an MPO uh, where now we look after boys that are coming from the streets. to take this journey. Um, look, um, I think in life it's all about sacrifices um, that one has to make in terms of uh, growth and also your career. You know, um, myself, I decided to do art full time. Uh, I was working as a lecturer and then I resigned uh, in 20, end of 2017. So I've been doing art uh, full time. So, so far it's been good, but indeed it does take a bit of sacrifice. Um, there's this hard work that you have to put in, you know, extra hours, no sleepless nights uh, that you that you have to go through. But uh, there's rewards for that. The more you work, um, the rewards are the more rewards that you get. find my style, I use um, monochrome and I use uh, also abstract uh, and also the mediums uh, that I use, I use most of the time I use acrylic and oil paint. So yeah, it, 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 that's my style that I use. of my work uh, get inspiration from uh, society, uh, the current issues that we're facing uh, as a country, uh, either you black or white, uh, Indian or colored. Uh, these are the issues that we, that we face uh, as a nation. Uh, the painting that I, that I actually did reflects uh, gender-based violence uh, where now, as I said, uh, it affects everybody uh, in our households and everybody uh, I, I think has, has uh, encountered such, um, such an issue. So what I'm trying to, to show people to be aware of it, uh, the more they're aware of it and People can speak about it and you know get educated as much as, as possible. Mm -hmm. 